name is Silver Draconis, and welcome back to Secrets of Grindia. I left the last episode off, ready to go on a grinding adventure, and I have. I have gotten a bunch of items, I can craft a bunch of things, and I have also sold a bunch of things. I now only have one of each of my, like, weapons and hats that you pick off from dudes. I have changed up my house, just because I felt like it, and I don't really have much else to spend my money on. So now this room is different, and I got all my weapons down here. Uh, this hasn't really changed, it just puts another painting up. And I got a room over here as well. I'm stuck. It's like a spring room. So, but, uh, all items. Do it. Arrows. Um, trying to remember what all I've picked up. I, I have done a bunch of farming as well because I'm trying to feed my pet up. I got all the fish in the winter area. I got that achievement, which gave me a Santa beard, which is kind of cool. But there is a yeti fish, a snow fish, an ice fish, a penguin fish, and I believe that was it. Yeah. So those are all those ones. And then I got this bracelet, this lavarm, la, larvarm, lav, larva armband, but it's like combined and I can't freaking say it. From those poison worms, the little squidge squidge worms, I don't know what the frick they're called. Uh, it ups my magic attack and casting per second, but I'm not gonna wear that because I'm not a magic person. And I got a whole bunch of other crafty materials, so I am ready to get uh, crafting, but first I also got a shield. This dropped from those bouncy mushroom guys, and it's literally a mushroom shield. I don't know what it does, what its special effect is, but it gives my shield plus 200 health, so heckle yes. Uh, I think that's everything to show in here. But yeah, I have sold a bunch of myself, so now all my weapons and things, I only have one of. I had a bunch of these gift box shields. I didn't even know what they dropped from those gift boxes. I actually hadn't realized that until freaking ages ago. Uh, so that's everything there, I believe. Uh, just double check. I made that. Yeah, I think that's everything. Yeah. So, now that that's all done, I also, I changed Jack's color to green because I was in the pumpkin woods. I was farming up for, like, pumpkin meat and pumpkin seeds to feed him. And I kept almost killing him. I mean, I technically can't kill him, I can't hit him, but I kept getting him confused. Because he's the exact same color as every other pumpkin. So, I changed his color. And if I take Slimy out again, I think I'm going to change Slimy's color. Or maybe not, I don't know, because I've encountered blue slimes, so who knows. Maybe I'll counter other pumpkin colors. But for now, I'm going to keep him green, because it was very confusing. But, let's craft up some stuff. First, I can craft up this hat, which is awful, but I made it. It's, at this point, it's the point of the matter, just making it. I can literally wear a bunch of mushrooms on my head. <laughs> That's amazing. Uh, so there's those. I don't think I had any weapons that I could make. No. I don't know what that is. It's very frustrating. Ah, no. Get back in there. Uh, shield and anyone. I did make, finally get enough for the freaking armor. The, those 30 little whatever pieces they are were really annoying. But I did get enough for that, and this one is actually a lot better, so I'm going to be putting this on. It has better defense, and it keeps my attacks per second nice and speedy, so awesome. Uh, I don't think I had anything else to make except for the crystal chisel. There. I'm now officially entirely out of those big ass crystals because I got exactly what I needed and nothing more. They are those are a pain in the butt to farm because you hit them a couple of times and then they spin around and go bing 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 all over the place. Meanwhile, you're fighting off blindness from the mushrooms, poison from the worms, and it's a mess. Is these are the exact type of enemies that I'm horrible at with the freaking poison and blinding effects and all that other oh crap, I'm horrible with it. I'm horrible. I mean, I'm obviously not too horrible because I'm not dead, but, you know, it, it's more annoying than anything. Like, I can deal with them, they're just really annoying. Also, I was looking in the shops when I was shelling, shelling? When I was selling stuff, uh, and I noticed that the jeweler's over here, oopsie, she's got some new rings. So, like, she's got a uh, smarter ring, which is smarter than the smart, a stronger ring, which is for that one. But I want to get this one, which is better than mine, which is a swifter ring. So, yes, please. Thank you. So, uh, wrong button. Fight him, and... 
So that's everything here. But also, before we go back to Mushroom Land, I noticed something because I was I was just kind of going all over fishing, getting berries and food items and all sorts of good stuff like that for my my little Jack. Uh, he's actually level two now. No, he's level three. So I've been working on feeding him. Which, but meanwhile, uh, I wanted to save the fish to show you guys, so I didn't feed him then. But now I can. It's really hard not to accidentally feed the pets the potions, especially when you got a bunch of stuff. Alright, and then actually doing that. Ah, and there. Okay. Now that's all that done. Come on, Jack. Uh, but I was coming down here, and I noticed this lady. So, I don't know what it is, because this wasn't here before, but I'm very excited to find out. Uh, apparently, I'm so excited I'm gonna slash her in the face. Okay. Let's try this again. Oh, it's not a lady. It is. Oh, it's Little Jay! Little John! He's uh, Robin Hood's friend. Robin's friend. I love all the references to different stuff, too. It's so cool. <laughs> hey, small fry! You managed to score a bow, I see. Still could be a bit better. To be honest, as far as bows goes, that one you got there is pretty garbage. I mean, I make do. I can fix it up a bit for you if you like. A man's gotta eat, though, so it won't be a pro bono. Won't be pro bono. I guess it. Uh, how about 15,000 gold and I'll turn that bow into something that you don't need to be ashamed of? Yeah, sure, I'll up my bow a bit. Right on! Give me that thing for a second. I don't know what voice to give him, so I'm just giving him a regular bow. So I got a composite bow. There you go, small fry. Might have some new designs later, so come back and check with me once in a while, alright? Cool, so I can upgrade my bow. Welcome back. Checking out some new wood that's straight from the tundra. It's hard as rock, so if you're game, I can use it to spiff off that bow here some more. I bet with this wood you'll be able to charge the bow enough to smack two enemies in a single shot. How about 5,000 gold? And I'll turn that bow into something to be proud. I don't know if I have 5,000 gold, but I'll say, nope, I like it. Okay, so that's another thing I can spend my money on, which is awesome. So now my bow is a bit better. I also, I noticed I can only hold 15 arrows, which kind of sucks, but oh well. Anyway, now back to the task at hand of what we were doing. Which was going to give this chisel to the lady. Uh, I still haven't completed the archery challenge. But everything else is starred. It's all nice. Except for here, which is new. But, you know. Give me a... <laughs> give me a minute. It'll... Well, more than a minute. But give me a little bit. It'll it'll get there. Also, I did get a couple of cards. Uh, it's annoying. I have to scroll down. I got the spin sect, which is the thing I had to farm for literally everything. This thing drops practically everything I needed. This, and then I got the little shroomy card. So this one increases my defense. This one, if I'm suffering from the blind default, crit is increased by 25, which is good, because these guys, when they die, they release patches of mushrooms that blind you. Which, you know, is fun. Just a bast. Uh, it was over here? No, it was down. Oops. Okay, it's down this way. I have a chisel to deliver. Yeah, these fucking worms. I'm being blinded. I'm surrounded by worms that are freaking killing me with their poison. And when you hit the worms, they speed up and run all over the place. And then these fuckers. It's very... It's a whole bunch of annoying things. All compounded in one area. Yeah, and then I'm blind. And you gotta... The mushrooms don't go away on their own. You have to pop them. To make them go away. So it's just... Ah. Anyway. Hey, Karina. Hey, that's exactly what I need! Great work! Are you really sure you want me to destroy this crystal, though? Yes! I want a smaller piece so I can haul it out of here! Dear goddess, how many times must I explain this? Alright then, here goes. Perfect! That pile of big crystal pieces will make me rich! I hope you realize large crystals are worth a lot because they are, you know, large. What do you mean? This is still a big crystal. It's just... Divide into smaller parts. It doesn't work like that, man. I'm pretty sure it's worthless now, honestly. What? Why didn't you any of you tell me? This thing was supposed to make me rich. Whatever. We held up our end of the bargain. Now cough up that valuable treasure you promised us. Uh, about that. Oh my goodness, a red diamond. What? Where? Bag. Why that little? Man, sorry about that, kid. Thought that guy knew what he was asking for. Hmm. There's still some pretty big chunks in there, actually. Tell you what, meet me back in Evergrind City. Might be able to salvage this. Okay. I'm game. 
I can take a little detour. The real Dr. Jones never would have done that. He would have put it in a museum. <laughs> Sorry. I just love that. Uh. Do, 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 do. Um, I think she was in... Ooh. Where did I meet her? Back in the cafe? Yeah, in the cafe. Hope I didn't ask for anything anymore. Oopsie. Apparently I'm gonna walk up the stairs. Hey, you're back! I hold one of the larger crystals blocks back here and worked on it for a bit. I managed to carve some pretty neat crystal pumps. You can have them. That's thanks for your helps with the Belmont before. See you around, kid. Let me know if you need something else. Cool. I got shoes. Ooh. 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 This pair of super fancy crystal shoes. They really help you focus your energy, but are tough to move in. Hmm. They're definitely good for magic. But I wonder what they're. Spe I wish it would tell me what the special effect is. Like. What is. Hmm. Maybe it'll tell me my character. No. It doesn't say anything. I wish I could know. It's like really tough to move in. It makes it sound like I'm slow. Oh. I'm probably, I'm not going to wear them anyway cuz I prefer the uh, attack up. But hmm, I'm going to wear something else. I have so many shoes now. Yeah, I'll probably just put my roller skates back on. I like being fast. But that's really cool. I got shoes now. Alright, so let's get back to where we were going. Which was... In here. Alright. Uh, that's solved. Um, and this is just back this way, I think. Yep. Alright, let's look around a bit more. I don't really remember what we're looking for. We're looking for an artifact, but I don't know where we'd find that. Sorry, kid. You can't go into these tunnels. They're filled with some kind of poisonous gas. We're going to close them off, but we need the official go-ahead from the top brass over in the merchandise. Hmm. Till then, we'll take turns standing guards so no one waltzes in here and croaks. Dead citizens are pretty bad for the company image, you know. Yeah. That reminds me, I, really, I keep going back and checking with that haggler thingamajiggin, whatever you call it, the the dude standing here. His prices keep changing. 4,804. And Bag still won't let me buy it! Yeah, it's like it's always like one more than what I have, and it's really annoying. <laughs> I really want to know what's in there. I wonder if I just spend all my gold and talk to him. Oh, it's a statue of Grindia. It's really cool that they're just kind of all over. It really enforces that she's like... I don't know. I don't know what I'm trying to say here, but like... It, it's cool that she's in all these ancient temples and like even the modern day imagery and stuff. Like, showing that, yeah, she is a pa the patron goddess here. She's not just something that's rarely talked about. I don't know. I don't know what I'm rambling on about, but it's, it, I, I find it cool. Yeah, this. This is what's annoying. Okay, so here's a caved-in tunnel. I'm just ignoring the enemies, because I don't want to deal with them, to be honest. Oh, that's right! Speaking of it, I did level up once. It's not a lot, but, you know. You do. Know. Uh, so I'm gonna get... I don't know what I'm gonna get, actually. Hmm. I don't know. I could up my this one a bit more because I really like using it. Hmm. Huh. I don't know. I'll get this one. I use this one so much. Oh, I unlocked it. Yes, now I can use gold. <laughs> okay, so it's when you get halfway that you can use the gold ones. Uh, I tend to just splurge them all. Ah, crap. 
No, 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 I should, I should, I should wait. Because then I can get these two up one, and then this one just needs two. We'll... I'll use one. So that's how I can charge it to go level. I'll use two, actually. There. Okay, now it's super powerful. Nice. And then there each one of these, and then these two will each get an extra one. Alright, 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 alright. Down. And I have one utility point, which, ugh. It's cool that they added all these extra things, but now it's just like, what one do I want? Oh, it was already hard enough deciding what one I wanted before, but now it's just like, I have so many options. I am gonna get EP regen, though. Just because. I want to be able to do more stuff. Alright. But finally I had something to spend my gold on. Oh my. This is actually a little clan of them. Uh, let's talk to this guy first. Hello. Oh, hello. <laughs> oh, why are you sad? I'm sorry, I can't talk right now. I'm too upset. Fluffy Feathers went missing yesterday, and she hasn't come back, and I don't know what to do without her. Whoa, this is so interesting. I can't deep fool you about all this. Bag, your sarcasm is practically fucking venomous. What's that, Silva? You saying we have to go? Oh, that's too bad. But I didn't say anything of that, Bag. Wait, your collectors! I heard rumors about you. If if I offer something valuable to you, you're obliged to help me, right? That's not how it works. I'm glad to help. Honestly, don't listen to this pile of fabric in my pocket. Don't worry. There's one thing of great value only that I can give you. It's called the Timekeeper's Crown. It has the power to control time, like to stop it and stuff. I've had great use of it over the years, but what is all the time in the world if I can't spend it with my fluffy feathers? You own an artifact capable of stopping time? Yeah, right. And I'm the master collector. Come on, Bag, let's just help the guy. You realize cheating a collector of a reward is punishable by jail? Bag, shut up! How dare you! The crown is very real, and I'll give it to you if you finally return fluffy feathers to me! Don't worry, Chinx. We'll get him back. Or her back, I guess. She's a cute little bird with milky white feathers. She makes really cute noises, like cluck and paca! Or was it cute? So fluffy feathers is a... chicken? Is a chicken a cute white bird with tiny cute little wings that make cute little sounds? I mean, yeah. Uh, people that are not me might describe them that way. <laughs> How would you describe them, Bag? Because I know you wouldn't describe anything as cute. <laughs> In that case, Fluffy Feathers is definitely a chicken. Please bring her back to me. Well, this is a win-win situation if I ever saw one. Let's bring in that chicken, kid. We we'll either get a great reward or the satisfaction of throwing one of these idiots in jail. Bag! Be nice! Find the lost pet Mount Bloom and herd it back to him. Ugh, I hate herding chickens. If you guys remember from the one episode that I had to herd chickens into a chicken coop, I'm not too good at it. But it's only one this time. It shouldn't be too bad, right? Wonder how long it'll take to roast this thing. I see people cooking stones like this in picture books, but I can't get it to work. It's supposed to be a marshmallow. Um, right then. Hello. Game is so close. Right now I'm in the lead. Wait, now he's in the lead. Now I'm in the lead again. Oh no, it's a tie. Are you guys playing war? What game are we playing? Haha, <laughs> as if a human could understand the rules. I mean, it sounds like war. Alright, I'll, I'll come back and talk to the king. I have a feeling the chicken is down this way. And I want to get that out of the way. Whoa. Maybe not. This looks like where a puzzle would be, but it's empty. This is blocked off. And there's like a dragon, but it has like different. I don't. Wow. Ooh. What's this? This is like just a dude. This isn't like a grindy symbol or anything. This is just a dude. Hmm. I wonder if this is. Maybe this is Zalamir. I don't know. I don't know. Alright, let's talk to this dude. Oh, another human? You guys are always fun to toy. Uh, hang around with. Make yourself at home. Alright. Cool. Well, I need to go this way. Um, but normally a chicken is in like the same area. How do I Where would a chicken be? I'm guessing it'd be like behind the closed off areas. Mm. You guys know where a chicken might be? Oh, hey. 
enemies in here. Oh, come on. Just let me look. I'll be fine. I'll be fine! I'll just be real quick. Alright. I don't know where the chicken is. I'm guessing it's either in that poisonous gas or in one of these sealed off areas, which I don't know how to clear. Uh, let's talk to this guy, though. Hello. Tai Ming? Oh, you're talking about Old Town. Yeah, that's past here, alright? Can't let you go through, though. And why is that? It's, uh, pretty dangerous. Ah, we'll be fine. So, you have to do me a little favor. You know, to prove yourself. Hey, kid, should we tell them about how many Frostlings we whacked back in Season A? Bag, you're not helping. I'm trying to be peaceful with these people. Cool story. I'm a caveling, though. We aren't monsters, so, uh, you can't kill us. This guy's no collector's law? Really? Ah, whatever. We'll just do that little favor of yours. Is it? I want to know the collector's law. I actually don't know that. Um. That's the spirit. It's not a difficult task. I just need you to fetch me a couple of things. Junk, really, but with some demental value. I'll even point you in the right direction. Check the cave with the large rock near the mountain exit. Oh, here, take this flute. Why do I need a flute? When you play it, some of my buddies will come to help you get rid of this rock. Wait, why did you say the word help in that way? It's pretty suspicious. I'm so sorry, Bag. Your voice is utterly destroyed. Huh, what? Help? How else would you say help? I'm just trying to be helpful, is all. <sighs> just go to the cave with the big rock and play the flute. Easy. Okay. I wonder if I played the flute. Hmm. Hang on. Got an idea. I have an idea. Just give me a second. Oh, good. The enemies came back. Uh, key items. I play the flute here. Oh, won't you let me click on it until I'm in that cave? All right, fair enough. Really wanted to, that wasn't even the right button. I really wanted to know where that chicken was though. Bye. Goodbye. Goodbye. Off. Stupid things. Uh, it should be over this way. Christ, by the time I actually get where I'm going, I'm gonna forget why I'm here. Uh, this one. Oh, wait! I heard a chicken. Hang on. There you are, you little bastard! What are you doing all the way here? Yeah. Oh, Christ, this is gonna be impossible. Well, it wasn't that cave anyway. I have to go back one, but I'm now that I found the chicken, I don't want to unfind it. Get up there. Come on, you fucker. Fucker clicker. Yeah. Stop getting stuck on the damn mushrooms. No. Come on. I'm really glad this isn't a Legend of Zelda thing where you, you hit the chicken too much and it fucks your shit. Oh, I don't want that. I just want to hit the chicken down. Because that would really suck. Ow! Bastard. Come on. Off you go. Hey! Leave the... Oh, I suddenly see a problem. No! So, if the chicken gets hit by something, it works like as if I hit it. Cool. Well, at least it's not affected by poison. That's awesome. Also, this chicken is behaving rather nicely. Get, get away from there. Go on, get in. Come on. Are you telling me it can't go that way? I can't fucking see. Uh, fucking crystals. Just go! Oh, well, here's the cave. This is the place, all right. Now give me a solo on that flute. Now give us a solo on that flute. What I get the feeling this is gonna call these bugs behind the walls. Ugh, I cannot play worse shit. Wow, kid. I thought all heroes could play one of these things. Hey, I'm not fucking Link, all right? Give me a break. All right, I'm the hero. Should have played it myself. All right, well, then you have a fucking go. Uh-oh. I guess the help has arrived. Prepare for anything. 
You got it, man. Oh, goody. I'm just thrilled by this. This just makes me happy. Fucking hell. I'm supposed to- oh, wait, I know what I need to do. Yep. It's like fucking pinball up in this bitch. Is there more than there used to be? I thought there was only three. I'm just kind of whacking them, hoping they go where I want them to. Oh, there's definitely more. Oh, I think I got it. Ooh, it lagged like a bitch, though. Alright, well, I got it. But, chicken. Hang on. Where the fuck did- Oh, it reset itself. Okay, so I wasn't supposed to fucking go that way anyway. Sorry for the swearing. Alright, come here. Alright, I got a loaded dice. Really? Alright, then. So that's why the chicken wouldn't go that way. It needs to go this way. Fuck off. Hell is the chicken. Chicken! Come back. Oh, Christ. This is gonna be a pain in my ass. Okay. So that actually worked. Good. This is a pain in my romp. This is a pain in my romp. Alright, I brought your chicken back. There you go. Eek! What is that thing? Get it away from me! It's a chicken. It's the chicken you sent us to find. What? How dare you call that hideous creature a chicken? Fluffy Feather's here. Now she's a real chicken. Oh my god, that is... I didn't even know it's the giant frickin' bird. Holy crap, that is... Alright then. Are you daft? That creature isn't anything at all like... Wait, what? If this thing is your Fluffy Feathers, then... Yes, you completely failed at your task. I'll be holding on to my timekeeper's crown. Thank you very much. Get that ugly creature away from here. It's making both me and Fluffy Feathers nervous. Well, I have a pet chicken. No, you can go to the farm. All right, well, I have my own Fluffy Feathers. I didn't expect to get the timekeeper crown anyway. All right. Well, I got a pet chicken now. So that's adorable. And we got your load of dice. Yeah, we did. We already did. You got it? I mean, of course you did. Did the spin sex actually help you? I guess they helped, in a way. <laughs> Just as I thought. I never lie, after all. Uh-huh. Great. Now get out of the way. Not so fast. This here was just one thing I asked for. Ask for a couple of things. Check your journal if you don't believe me. Eh? He's right. The other thing I want is in cave to the south of here, right next to the waterfall face. There's no rock blocking the way or anything, so this should be a walk in the park, so to speak. Again! What are these guys? A, go a tribe of goblin lawyers? No oh, shit. <sighs> we'll get you that one other thing. After that, you better move. Of course, a deal is a deal after all. The thing I want says, it's cave to the south next to the wall. Wait a minute. Cape to the south, next... Isn't that... Or isn't this cave? I was gonna say, if it's this one, then I'll... I'm... Whoa! Did you guys see that? Holy shit! <laughs> oh, yes. But I was gonna say... I think it's this empty cave. The one with the poisonous gas in it. Sorry, kid. You can't go in the tunnels. I feel the kind of poison gas. We're going to close them off. Well, no, maybe it's not. Okay. Where am I going, then? I'm not going there. Where am I going? God. Matter of time. A tiny little... Oh, that's like the main one, but... Cave and Cove. Let's fix mountain. You're asking a couple things. Be the details. Find the second. That's not helpful. 
don't remember where to go exactly. Alright, well, they said a cave to the southwest. So, let's try down here. Oh, wait a minute. What is this guy? It's this guy! What the fuck? I ain't got that kind of scratch. What the hell? I'll give you one gold. Tempting offer, but I won't go below 10,000. Or a thousand. Let's settle on two gold. Uh, a hundred? Three. Ten gold! Four gold. One gold! <laughs> Bag, what the fuck? How'd you do that? No, wait! <laughs> what an idiot. I, I can't believe it. I was outwitted by a human? Technically a bag, but yeah, I'll take the credit for that one, sure. Keep your gold, but please don't tell the others. I've got a reputation to maintain. I thought I read it wrong at first that it was 10,000, but... <laughs> nope, he just kept going down. Did he just call me a human? I never felt this insulted in my life. Hey, I'm a human. Ah, oh, well. Let's get inside and get that whatever it is we'll find. Being a human's not so bad. I mean, it's not like being an eternal ancient artifact that can hold practically everything, but I mean, it's not the worst thing in the world. It could be a slime. Okay, I don't get the feeling this big empty cave is gonna have more snooze in it than I bargained for. Well, but this episode has gone on a little bit too long, so in the next episode, we will find out what is inside this cave, which I have a feeling is not going to be empty, but in fact filled with horrible, terrible things. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, let me know. If you didn't, let me know. If you got any tips or tricks or anything you want to see me do, comments down below, and I will see you all in the next video. Bye!